What's going on everybody? Rooster here in Tennessee with another video and uh, another one of these that I like to say is one of my favorite amps TX800 uh, also called a LA900 uh, comes with the two fans on top came factory with that fan kit on it some of these they had them where they were thermally activated and some of them ran all the time this one runs all the time uh, it is a one drive and four it does have Toshiba 2879's in it um, for those interested the preamp is kind of so-so in it kind of works kind of doesn't makes very little to any the very little difference if any at all uh, AM and sideband works of course the light does work there on the preamp but again it makes a very minimal difference but the, the delay does work on it high medium and low works um, this is just a beast of an amplifier and doesn't have a huge footprint for a uh, one drive and four very good talking amp and uh, I'll go ahead and say if this one doesn't sell uh, within a week of me posting it I'm gonna put it in the truck and uh, run it for a little while I'm gonna take the little two pill out and uh, put this put this thing right here in and uh, have some fun talking on it but uh, TX800 super nice amp now we're gonna drive it with our Galaxy 44 doing about 35 watts PEP we're gonna test it on average and peak power and we've got it running a little bit over 14 volts on our uh, power supply. And I'll try to let you guys know the, uh, the amp draw on it and stuff as we go. With that being said, we've got a 1,000 watt slug in here looking at the uh, bottom scale. And we're going to start out on low power. Let's see. And yeah, we'll start out on medium and work our way up. We'll go on average and then we'll go to peak. So this is average power. Hello, audio. Let me put a little carrier in there with it. Audio. Well, you can see it's getting down with the amperage over there. Over 40 amps draw at 14 and a half volts. Audio. About 275 watts average. We're going to go low. Hello. Hello. About the same on average on the audio talking hello one two three about 200 watts average now we're going to go to high hello audio one two three audio audio showing about 300 watts on audio talking hello one two three audio one two three Talking 280, 300, audio test. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, audio. Put some more carrier in it. Key in less than 100 watts, audio. 1, 2, 1, 2, 3, audio. Going to about 300 average. <clears throat> and you can see it was drawing over 40 amps, I believe. Hello. showing about 350 average with that hello audio with that audio in there and drawing over 50 amps so uh, she's drawing some power now let's go to peak same uh, same scale we're on high power we'll just work our way down audio test one two three audio test one two three audio test one two three audio test audio radio one two three audio radio 850 peak we'll go to low audio test one two three audio test one two three audio test one two three about 650 peak go to medium audio test one two three audio test one two three audio test one two three about 800 on medium uh sideband delay we'll just key it up and let you hear the uh, delay on it good working sideband delay and uh, I've done videos on these before guys and every one of them I get it's like pains me to get rid of it <laughs> uh, but I always end up selling them anyway you know I guess they say uh, money talks and uh, uh, you know what walks there so uh, I hate to get rid of this, this thing and I won't get rid of it if it lasts more than a week I'll keep it keep it for a little while anyway but uh, I think this will make somebody a hell of an amp, a uh, good amp, even to run in your house if you wanted to on a power supply. And they don't make them anymore, 
so they're not getting any easier to find and they run pretty dang cool um, for what they are they're in a small case but uh, lots of cooling on there and uh, they do a good job I like them no more no less than eight gauge wire I recommend six but uh, nothing less than eight that's it guys TX 800 I have a lot of people hit me up looking for one of these and I don't think you're going to find one much better than this one. It's a nice one. Uh, questions, comments, complaints, let me know. Any interest, uh, interest in it, 423-299-3535. Shoot me a text message and uh, we'll get you hooked up. See you. Bye. Bye-bye-bye.